We back. Fly Free Sports. This is week five NFL picks. We back. Look, as promised, we did better than last week. 11 and 5 record for week four. We on to the next. And hey, like I say every week, let's do better this week. Why not? Uh, let's jump straight into it. Thursday night joint Bears Commanders. I don't have the Bears win a game for a while. Straight up. I think the commanders were impressive against the Eagles. They came up short, but it was an impressive showing, especially by Sam Howell. He uh he he I don't want to say he made a believer out of me, but he he played very well, man, in a hostile environment. So that 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 means a lot, man, you know, for a young quarterback, you know, in our division as well. So let me get the commanders against the Bears, man. Uh Jaguars, Bills, Bills are rolling. They look real impressive, man. They 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 smoked Miami. I didn't see that one coming, but you know it's not too big of a surprise, I guess. The Bills are an upper echelon team. They have been for you know over the last three years. Uh, the Jaguars they pretty been pretty inconsistent this year, you know, but uh, they pulled it out in London against Atlanta. I will go with the Bills at home. I don't think the Jaguars are ready for that type of smoke. Texans, Falcons. The Texans have been the surprise team of the year so far, I would say. Uh, C.J. Stroud looking like he about to get rookie of the year. Didn't see that one coming. I'd be lying if I told you I predicted it. Uh, But they are very impressive so far, so... But I do think the Falcons regain form back at the crib uh, and go three and two. They snapped their two game losing streak. Desmond Ritter got to step his game up. But I do believe the Falcons will win that game. Deshaun Robinson, man. Hey, I called that one. But I got the Falcons in that game. Uh, Panthers, Lions. The Lions are very, 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 very impressive, man. I expected that coming into the year. Offensively, they they look great. Uh, Carolina's not getting their first win of the season in Detroit. I can guarantee you that. I think that's like the lock of the week right there. Uh, yeah. Titans, Colts. The Titans smoked. Uh, who they smoked? They smoked uh, Cincinnati. Killed them. I think I'm pretty much done with Cincinnati on my bets. Like, in and my picks, bets, all that. Like, they they done. They've done enough. Uh, the Colts, they, they've they been pretty up and down as well. Um, But surprisingly so, though. I mean, I don't think people expected too much out of the Colts coming into the year. But they've been a little bit better than expected. But I do have the Titans in this game. Look like Derrick Henry finally, uh, finally did something once I traded him off my fantasy team. But that's a whole other story. But I'll take the Titans. Giants, Dolphins. Let me get the Giants. No explanation needed. Uh, Saints and Patriots. The Patriots look god awful on offense. I don't know if Bill Belichick is going to uh, survive this storm. He probably will because he's Bill Belichick. But I think any other coach under any other circumstance will probably be up out of there because uh, they look awful. Mac Jones is horrible. They got fucking pummeled by the Cowboys. Like it was, it was ugly. It's just no no way around it. Uh, the Saints, I don't really, I'm not really, you know, too high on them. They just got smoked too by the Bucks. It's a hard game to pick. Saints on the road, Patriots at home. Uh, damn. Give me the Patriots. Can't believe I just said that shit, but give me the Patriots. Uh, Ravens and the Steelers. The Steelers look fucking awful. They got smoked by by the Houston Texans. Had C.J. Stroud out there doing whatever he wanted to do. Uh, and I ain't even watched the game. I'm just gonna keep it a buck. Like it just looked like looking at the box score, like he was doing whatever he wanted to do. 
So, yeah, I think Lamar Jackson will have similar success on the road. Give me the Ravens. Eagles, Rams. I hate picking the Eagles, but got to be realistic. The Rams do have a chance. You know, they they haven't laid down for anybody this year. That's that's a fact, but I think the Eagles, I think the Eagles will win a close game. Let me get them. Bengals and Cardinals. Like I said, I'm done with the Bengals. Them niggas is trash. Like I I've seen enough through four weeks to know now and it, it, it something is broken on that team. It's simple as that. Um like I said last week, I've been impressed with Josh Dobbs. Even the game uh, this past week against the 49ers, he was real impressive in that game. Uh, their defense just couldn't stop Christian McCaffrey, who went fucking wild on them niggas. He got like four or five touchdowns. It was, it was pretty crazy. But let me get the Cardinals in that game. I don't trust the Bengals at all. Get them out of here. Uh, Broncos, Jets. The Jets actually looked pretty good against the Chiefs. I didn't expect that. Uh, they put up a very good fight and probably would have won if Zach Wilson didn't uh, fumble that snap. Uh, uh, I think they beat the Broncos. I, I'm not impressed by the Broncos. They had to come back on the Bears. Like, you shouldn't be down by whatever they was down. Whatever they was down to the Bears, they shouldn't have been down that. So uh, I think I'm I'm about done trusting them too. So give me the Jets. Chiefs. Vikings, give me the Chiefs. The Vikings still didn't look impressive. They won their first game of the year, but nothing to write home about, man. So get them out of here too. Pack them up. Chiefs win. Uh, Cowboys, 49ers. The 49ers have been pretty much the most consistent team in the NFC. If I had to pick one, uh, they're not overly impressive, but like I said, they're very, very consistent. They know what they want to do. They have an identity. You know, everybody's bought in the Kyle Shanahan, obviously, uh, IU, uh, Debo Samuel, Kittle, Brock Purdy, McCaffrey, uh, you know, use check all them guys, man. They all solid vets, man. Uh, except for, of course, uh, Brock Purdy, but they beat the Cowboys handily. I think at home on prime time. Yeah. Give me the 49 uh, Monday night Packers and the Raiders. That's a tough game to pick because neither one have been that great. Uh, Packers have been better than them, though. I will take Green Bay on the road. Jordan Love bounces back. I think they've alternated wins this whole year. Win, loss, win, loss. So I think they're due for a win this week. They just lost to the Lions. So let me get Green Bay to continue that streak. And that will be, yeah, that's it. Week five picks, man. Fly free sports. And, man, y'all keep it locked in with me each and every week, man, for my picks. Uh, like I said, we're going to try to do better and better and better every week. Uh, Yeah. Like I said, keep it locked. Uh, Like, share, subscribe, all that good shit, man. We out. I love you.